All right, so today I actually want to talk about a gear talent that I think a lot of people have uh, missed out on. So let's just uh, get into it. So the talent is called uh, Focus, and this is the perfect version of it, pristine example. So perfect focus is 60% maximum damage, while the normal one is 50%, gaining 5, and that's the difference basically. So what does it do though? Increase total weapon damage by 6% every second you are aiming while scoped 8x or higher, up to 60%. So let's go through the scope that it actually works with. So you need 8x or more in zoom. So obviously the 8x, this one will work. It looks like this. You can see the bar below the, the ammo count charging up. I guess I could shoot just to show more damage. This is not the sniper build on, by the way. And then you can scope out. You can still zoom in for around one second, right? So you have a little bit of room there where you can like move and then still scope in. But if you are, yeah, you see there, there, uh, there it uh, disappeared. But you still have like some lead room to actually go in and out with it. And we're going to come to some more techniques later. But yeah, so 8x, 12x. And even the digital scope as well works for the focus buff. So this is a pretty good alternative to like the glass cannon, for example, because you don't take the extra damage. But you need to use the scope. But I think a lot of people thought that this would only work for one bullet. That's at least what I thought when I read it quick. But then I looked into it more and it actually is up all the time. But then if you play Division 2 for a bit, then you know there have been some issues with the shield. So if you, for example, use this shield right here, you can zoom in while not getting this the bigger scope that we have, right? So if you look at the damage here, 2 million, 2.1 million, and we'll let it charge up here. Up. Almost 3 million, so almost a 1 million increase there for the 60% add additive damage. Keep in mind, this is not <laughs> a, a rifle build or anything. It's put together random pieces. But just to show you guys. So this is extremely strong to use. And especially since you have the shield. And I mean, worth to notice that this works with all the weapons that can equip those. We can equip... Uh, what do we want to do? LMG, you can't use a shield on. You can't use a sniper, but you could use an AR or even a shotgun. But let's take uh, let's take Eagle Bear. No, we can't do that as a as a test. Do you have any? Okay, we have a FAMAS. So let's put a uh, let's just do extreme. Let's put a 12x on the FAMAS. So without the shield, we would have to play like this with focus. But we use the shield, and we on third person person view so one bullet here it's 400k let's charge it up with this additive damage we gotta we still gotta keep zoom in though you have to aid this if you go hip fire you lose it right then we're gonna shoot her 418 so this is actually what we created before let's see what a crit is at so 600k crit from 400k. I wonder if you still get the headshot damage from that though. I just want to check that quick. If we zoom in quick there. 296. 300. And then we take away this one. We do the same thing. So you still do get the damage uh, from the scope as well when you are zoomed in with the shield. So this is definitely something they have to fix. I don't think this is intended at all. It's just smart use of mechanics, I guess. But, but honestly, this is just so stupid that it works. Like, I think the talent itself should only work with snipers. Because you don't want to have people running a shield with a 12x AR. And just abusing the shit out of it. Like, the main point of the talent is to just sit... With a sniper and you sit in a scope, right? But anyway, that's something that you can do right now. So I thought I would let you guys know. But I think that will cover the talent though. Just thought I would make a quick video explaining how it works and what it... 
And hopefully they fix this or say if they want it to be like this. Anyway, hope you guys found this video useful and see you guys in the next one.